Alright, so what is going on guys? This is Ollie Lee Ruby for Wolfpack Productions, where yeah, you can be sure big things pop and little things stop. And I've actually gotten a few a few requests to do this tutorial, and so I'm going to try and pull it off for you. This is how to this is how to install new arenas in the WWE 2K19. Now, the <clears throat> first thing we're gonna do, uh, we're looking at this list of arenas. You wanna pick you want to pick out which arena you want to pull. Since my game, I'm not using anything with Minitrons. We're going to go... I'm going to go somewhere in the range of... Well, first off, let's... Let's see if we can zoom out here so you can see it better. There you go. Now, this was the only way I was actually able to get this to show up. So, I've, I'm going to go to... Let's see, I've got both superstars is already... And you also want to... You can use any slot. A slot doesn't matter as long as you don't have something there. <clears throat> also, I need to mention what you need. You need eras, which I can't give. You need uh, the ported arenas pack. I can't give that. And uh, you need Russell Minus. You need pack editor. And I believe that's... Oh, yeah, that's that'll be it. But <clears throat> for the most part... Uh, you can come on over to the pro the uh, mods for all Discord, and we can see what we can do to get you those tools. But right now, what we're looking at is this right here. This is the arena list from Eras. And uh, now, what I want to show you is the arena list that I have from from the from my own game. Let's put this up here. Give me one moment. And now you see that, don't you? Let's see if I can bloop, I can uh, bring this in just a little bit. It didn't work. No, that doesn't work either. Uh, that'll work best. Okay, so <clears throat> let's pick an arena. If, like, for example, if I want to go back to the eras thing here. And I want to, let's say that I wanted to do Survivor Series 89 and put that where in X, where, uh, uh, no, there's two ways you can do this. You can do this where you put the arena in a whole other spot, or you can do it where you keep the spot it's in. Now, let's go back and take a look at my list to determine where this is going to go. So let me see, the original number for that was, I said Survivor Series 89, that'd be WrestleMania 34, which is in 15. Let's see if we've already got something in there. Answer to that would be, no I don't, WrestleMania 34 is free. Okay, so... <clears throat> to do this in the regular arena spot, for example, what you want to do, I'm going to go to another instance of, you're going to need at least two or three, I use three instances of Wrestle Minus, one for the string, string, which you need the super string for this, by the way, but you can get that straight out of a CCT. And uh, let's see, let's see if I can find the other Wrestle Minus variation here that I have. Let me just one, one minute in a sec. Whatever your list is, you find the arena. In this case, it's going to be Survivor Series 89, which is number 15. And I'm going to put these down. At, what? Wrong one. For now, we don't need the Misco one for right now. <clears throat> we need these two. So we're going to scroll all the way down to 15, or all the way up in this case. Notice that I have 14 missing. That was a broken arena slot. For me, I could never get it to work, so I just deleted. Okay, so for stadium, you want to plug in 20. Then 0, 10 for the corner post. Lead, they didn't have a lead corner or lead anything back then, so... Rope is five. <clears throat> Apron. Now this is where it could get a little tricky. 100 is what, what they have, but I get a feeling 100 is already in use. Let's, fig, let's find that out before we ever do anything. 
Let's see if we've got a 100 open. We should. I don't know if we should or not because I haven't been this way yet, but it looks to me like we do have a 100 already open. That's all right. That's that's nifty. That's nice. So we can use 100 then. Back up to 15 here. <clears throat> Lead apron. I don't know why that set at zero. Oh, wait. Okay, so. 20, zero, 10. Okay, yeah. So LED apron minus one. That removes it. Turnbuckle two, I think is what it says there. Yeah, two. And then barricade four. Fence. Uh, you want to do... Looks like that's going to be fence number 27. Sea light. That's 10. <clears throat> Spotlight. It's, wait a minute. Sea light is actually 5, I think. No, we had it right. 10. No, it is 5. Okay, 5. 10. I want to make sure you get all these numbers correct. I've had this happen in the past where it wouldn't load because one of the numbers wasn't right or something was missing. Ring mat stays where it is. Floor mat, 13. Oh, we're going to drag this over just to see here. Crowd is the next thing we need to pay attention to here. 94. And then we can leave all this alone. And the IBL. That's 21. And that should give us what we need there. Now we're going to hit save changes. And give me one second. I'm going to bring the top, the, uh, top row here up to... I'm going to bring the... Uh, you're looking at the split screen. I'm going to bring the bottom one up here all the way. Give me just one set. <clears throat> Alright, so that's as up as I can get. I guess I'll open it. I'll do it in post anyway. What we want to do now... Let's go back to Arena 15. Our miss view. <coughs> 15. And we want to check to make sure everything is there. There's probably going to be something missing, though. I will say that. So what we're going to do here... I'm actually going to go to the right folder here in my thing here. Anyway, let's get this where we need it. And uh, I'm on the other window capture here. And for this one, <clears throat> I'm going to switch to my ears folder here. Well, not, not that one. Not that one. Uh, there we go. Eras Arenas is what we need. And we also are going to need, oh, this is going to get really messy. So I'm going to hide the other window. I don't think, yeah, there's not a way I can pull this off. So I'll just explain what I'm doing. And uh, we'll do it that way. So <clears throat> first thing we look for in your ERAs folder. Now these are going to go, everything here will go into 2K19 Pack Arena. And these folders, I need. I feel like I need to show these folders right here, so I'm going to go ahead and grab another window capture here. Okay, so I need to show this. <clears throat> these, All these folders you see right here, these are going to be your... The, this is what you're working with for the most part for the arena part. I'll explain the logo part a bit later. Anyway, the first thing that I'm going to do here... Let's look for Stadium 20. That should be there, actually. Found a stadium. Yeah, it's there. As I suspected. Now, the apron is the first thing I know of that shouldn't be there. Wait, where did I get 100 from? 
It's 90 actually, but our apron 90 is there. So what you do if you do have an apron 90, you can do two things or an apron, whatever you're looking for. <clears throat> you can change this number to something else. Like for example, let's say 215. And then what you can do, you take your apron 90 and you're going to want pack editor for this. Extract this. Wait, don't no, I I actually messed up a bit. You have to take the one out of that era's folder that you need. So let me find that. Hang on just a minute here. Here is arenas. <clears throat> 87 to 89. Apron. The original apron. Num actually, in this case, if you're working with eras like we are here, it's actually going to be in the base folder. The base folder of eras. Now this is this basic process. I'm using it on errors, but you can use it on any arena that, that you can possibly find. Any of these will do. Anyway, apron, and you want 90 out of here. Pull this into here. Obviously, it's going to be the same, but <clears throat> different. It'll change the arena. It'll change the apron graphics. Is what it's going to do, but. And then I'm going to take a random arena, a random number out of here, like 407. And I'm going to take it back to the apron folder over here. Because I know there isn't a 407. At least, not by default. I had it changed, however. I had my arena changed. So let's go ch check and see what the arena number was that we used. It's 215. So back in here, 407, the number of 407 is going to change to 215. <clears throat> then you drag 215 into Pack Editor. Okay, let me, hang on, let me switch this. I didn't realize this wasn't, this was not on the right thing. Okay, so we have Pack Editor here. Let me just blow this up real quick. Anyway, you see that apron 407 is there. You hit inject, you find the file you need, and <clears throat> now the other way you can do this is you can just inject straight into the file that it's asking for. I'll show you how to do that here in a minute. Anyway, we're going to clean this window thing up. And I'm now going to go over to, hang on, just a minute. We're going to go over to, we're going to continue at, we're going to, um, what are we going to do? I got to continue making sure that things are here. What I mean is that we have April 215. <clears throat> now let's go back to our, um, our, our um, Russell Plus, or Russell Minus here, sorry. I said Russell Plus. I know. All the rest of this stuff we should be good on. So, I'm going to make sure though. Stadium 20 should be there. Yes. The only thing that would have been had to worry about, you'd have to worry about, would probably be the IBL at some points. Because as you can tell here, I'm going to show this. Give me one minute. Okay, let me get back to where I need to be here. This is kind of messy. So anyway, as you see here, the IBL goes to 92. What IBL did we need? <clears throat> we needed 94, which is not here. 
Easy fix. I'm going to find that folder right over here. And this is again going to be in base. So, Arena IBL. Wait, IBL 94? Is that. Am I looking in the right column? Feels like I wasn't, but. No, it was Crowd 94. I'm an idiot. Sorry. IBL here is 5, actually, according to this. Wait, it's 15, not 13. Okay, so. Crowd 98. That might not be there. 36 for the IBL is. So. We're going to go check the crowd stuff now. Because <clears throat> one of the most common problems I've run into is that I would forget to put in, or I, I didn't realize that I had forgotten to put in, say, the stadium because I thought it was already there when it clearly wasn't. Or I just missed some overall files that made it work. Anyway, what was the uh, crowd number? It was 94, I think. 98. That should be there. Let's check that just to be sure. Not that one. Uh, let's see. It was it was crowd that we were looking for. And crowd number 94 it said is there. So, everything is there. Once you know everything's there, what you want to do now is we're going to do the logos now. So, that said, <clears throat> you don't need... Actually, no. We, yeah, let's go ahead and rename it first, actually. This is an easy part of it. This will lead right into the logo stuff. So, what you want to do here for... <clears throat> I'm going to shift back over to Russell Minus now. As you see there, this, this here, if I can make it bigger for you, oh, let me see if I can make this bigger. This is the uh, MISCO 1. This is how you're going to rename it along with the string file. See, what you do here. <clears throat> what you want to actually do, we're going to go to Arena 15 here. And I'm not going to show the string file on here because mine's different than yours probably. So <clears throat> we go to WrestleMania 34's Arena here. And then I'm going to head over to my string file. La -dee -da -dee -da. There we go. And we should have, <coughs> excuse me. We should have the arena that we're looking at here. I'll be searching up Survivor Series. If you have a super string, it's basically, yours will be the same as mine. But I've got a few extra names added to mine for like characters and stuff like that. So it was, what was it? Survivor Series 89 is what we were working on? Yeah, Survivor Series 89. So I'm going to take that four, four, in this case, the four, the four, the four digit string code is 52B0. You're going to take that and where it says SCR name right here, you'll just do this, copy paste or paste it over, <coughs> save the changes. And once you come back, you'll notice that our WrestleMania arena is now Survivor Series 89. However, <coughs> you want to do one more thing over here. And this comes, this little tip comes from Chi towns Deuce over at M4A. What you want to do is you want to scroll all the way over until you see BAR right here. Now, notice this already has the correct number, 7. So that'll fix the barricades. But what if you have a stage that's floating? In that case, if it's a stage that's on the floor, and the person comes out looking like they're floating. Like, I had to do this with several of my other floor arenas. So, that is to say, ones where the, where the uh, ramp is replaced by a solid floor. So, <clears throat> I had this 
issue with my Superstars 89 arena that I installed. So let's go up here and see what we did. Stage, you set that to zero. And it should fix the floating. Now, this stage is set to one, so we'll set it to zero. And uh, we'll click and save changes. <clears throat> That's all you need Russell minus four at this moment in time. I'm not actually going to put the logos in yet, as I want to see if the game works. I want, I want to see if this works first. So, I'm not going to show this because everybody knows how to do it, but what you do is you go over to uh, CCT, and you're going to... <clears throat> you're going to go where it says Chunk Tools and hit Regenerate Chunk Zero, and then you just hit Start, and it auto does it for you. And I will be back after the game loads in just a minute. All right, so we're back. And I'm actually going to try this out to see if this loads. To do that, we're going to, we're going to find our rate. Of course, there's no, uh, no logo on it yet. You can find it by the name. <clears throat> so let's see if this loads or not. It should because I, I believe everything is there from the start, but in the case that it doesn't load, I'll cut this out and then I'll explain why it didn't load to you guys. So this is what one of the most common thing that I run into is the uh, missing files. So the, that's what a infinite load actually means. So what we're going to do, <clears throat> I'm going to pause and we're going to try this again. I'll see you in a second. All right. So we are back in uh, Russell Minus now. <clears throat> what I want to make sure of is that everything we need is here. Starting with Crowd94, which is here. Stadium20 should be here. I don't know why it wouldn't be. It is. Corner Post 10 should also be here. I think I might know here. Corner Post 10 is indeed here. <clears throat> apron is not 100 though i actually made a different i made it 213 or 215 or something i know that's there because we did that earlier in the video so we'll skip that barricade four which should be here it is next number over is 27 that's gonna be the fence <clears throat> check that's there uh, Crowd94, I believe, is there. We've already checked that. Hmm. Try to figure out what it is missing here. I can guarantee you the ring and floor mat aren't missing. Let's just make sure. <clears throat> okay, so, what was the ring mat? That was zero. That's obviously going to be there. Floor mat one will obviously be there as well. Is it floor or floor mat? It's floor mattress, not floor. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, that's there. Crowd 94, I believe I checked and that's there as well. So I'm trying to figure out why it is, why it doesn't want to load. Yeah, 94 is actually there already. So let's go back and look again. <clears throat> Stadium 20 should be there. It is. Let's see. Now let's bring up mine. That way I can actually tell what's wrong. So... <clears throat> Mine, I mean, my edit didn't miss go one, miss o four, whatever to start, but is this it? Yeah, that's it. <clears throat> okay, so number fifteen is twenty zero to two fifteen. Make sure the apron has the right name, obviously, but. Yeah, it's there. I'm not seeing anything wrong here. Uh, 
Barricade 4 should be there. <clears throat> There's several other arenas that uses that, I think. Turnbuckle 2 also should be there. Yep, it's there. Honestly, I probably should have kept the uh, thing at 100, but it's worked in the... For me, it's worked in the 300s before, so I don't think it's that. Uh, entrance, we need to make sure... 15 should be there. Which, by the way, I forgot to actually cover something here, so... Wait a minute. Why is that out of order? 15. Okay, so while we're here... <clears throat> since the injection process is, for, is the same for just about any file, you don't need to really do much... I don't need to show you, but you, you're just going to extract the uh, stadium file. <clears throat> Not that one. The, from ERAs or whatever entrance file you got it from. And, uh... Let me see if I can find the stupid thing again. There we go. So, ERAs or ERAs. And then pack, arena entrance, <clears throat> then we need 15, right here. And you extract that and you're going to put it <clears throat> in place of the other one. I'm going to figure out what this is, what's going on with this thing though, because I, I checked twice, I have everything, so... Yeah, I've had this problem before, but anyway. Drag that in. And bingo. <clears throat> what I just did there is I extract I I put that in. It's actually I don't have a 100 for the arena. I'm actually going to ch change that back to 100 for the apron. See if that did the trick. It probably will. Just watch. <laughs> but, in the case that there is a 100 for the apron, which uh, there is, <clears throat> what you want to do is, so you don't over, so you, what you want to do is what I'm trying to say. I'll, I'll I can English, I'll say it at some point. Uh, where is it? Shoot, I really need to, there we go. You go back to wherever you have your ERAs files backed up, and you do need these backed up. I have them on a separate hard drive. <coughs> and you're going to find the, <coughs> excuse me, the apron you need. Which in this case, we need number 100. Extract this, <clears throat> and then I'm going to go over to my game files, which I also have on a hard drive because, for reasons. I think it makes it run a little bit quicker, but other than that, you're going to put it into this 100 file. But before we do that, I'm going to go ahead and delete 215 if I haven't already, which I haven't. <clears throat> so what you do here, 100. Now what I'm doing here is I'm injecting the apron file from ERAs into this 100. <clears throat> I will show this because I feel like this is important enough to show. Therefore, pack editor. Okay, so let's go ahead and see if I can get this to transform, fit to sphere, there we go. So you see we're into an AR apron 00100 here. <clears throat> you click and check file, and that file we just injected onto, extracted onto the desktop will go in, and then you're going to want to regen again. And I'm going to pause again while I load the game. All right, so we're back in game now. now let me switch it. Whoops. There we go. So <clears throat> you can see that I'm, I don't have the right arena pick, but that'll, that won't take long. Innocence. 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 
Yeah, I'm kind of rocking. I know. Survivor Series 89. I want to make sure this works before I do anything with logos. And it still doesn't work, so I'm going to figure out what's going on here. <clears throat> and while I do that, I'm going to pause the video for you. So we'll see you in a minute. <clears throat> All right, so we're back, and after a few tweaks and things, guess what? The arena works. Let me let's uh, let's show it off, and then we'll put the we'll put the uh, logos in and the versus screen. I can't get rid of that stage. I don't know what's going on there, but the phenomenal AJ hey, Styles. If you guys know what's going on with the staging area, let me know. How it still shows the WrestleMania stuff. However, we could have put this in another spot if we wanted to. All right, so let's take a look and see what what we have here. We have barricades that need to be fixed. I'll do that off screen. <clears throat> we have the correct Survivor Series arena here. Although I don't know why that says Clash of the Champions here on the table. Anyway, now that we know that works, we're going to pause one more time and then I'll show you how to do logos and such. All right, so for logos, as you can see here, we have, I have two folders up. I have the top one is my game files, and the second one is going to be from Eras. So what we want to do is I want to take my Eras folder right here. We're going to go to win, and I have Era 2, 87 80 to 89 because that's where the Survivor Series logo actually is. I just want to point out, I did say there would be a tutorial on how to swap arenas. It's practically the same process, except there are a f few files that I'll explain later that I need that you do need to swap out. Like, take what we did with the apron. If I had kept that in 215 like I originally wanted to, that would be the same process as doing the arena swap. So if you just change the number 50, you just, ch I'll, you know what, I'll explain this in, in another brief tutorial. It won't take that long. Anyway, all that said, sorry about all that, all that extra expedition, exposition or whatever it was, but you had a <coughs> pack menu, win assets, and then for this you got single read, and then texture, and then PPV logo. Now, I want to show you something. Some of these logos are going to replace these because these are from the, uh, these right here are going to be from the uh, Ported Arenas pack and from something else you're going to need to effectively do the job here. <clears throat> you need uh, C Fusion's Unpacked Graphics. Again, I can't link you to that. It's on, it's on CC Mods, which I'm not throwing a link to, by the way. You can ask just Ben or Kazir for that link. It's their site. And again, come on in the M4A Discord. We'll help you out. Anyway, PPV logo now. <clears throat> and what we look for... Actually, you want... Yeah, like I said, you want your era logo. I was in the wrong folder. You want a uh, single read. Texture. PPV logo. In this case, we're looking for number 15. WrestleMania 34. What you're going to do is you're going to put that in here, extract it out here, and then you're going to pull that same number out of here and throw that in. Now, it should be the same as the other one, but the size might not be the same, if that makes sense. In this case, it isn't, but still. You delete the back file, and then again, you're going to reach in. And basically, I'm not going to show the full, you know, logo, locator, and all that process. It's the same. 
what you're doing for the logo now, you'll do it for the locator, you'll do it for the nameplate as well, and all that. I'll go ahead, I'm going to do an Eras Arena Showcase series where I will show the full arenas as they are completed. Anyway, you're going to, you're going to <clears throat> do it again for the, every time you inject, you uh, regen. Anyway, guys, I'm not going to show the logo working. So that's going to be the end for this tutorial. Like, comment, subscribe, and if you're into this kind of modding thing, come join us at the M4A Discord. Link below. And uh, remember to follow me on Twitter, like the video, leave a comment, leave comment, do all that. And I will see you guys again soon. Bye-bye.